Hello, and welcome to English Tutorials System.io YouTube channel. You can check out the video description to download our premium System.io free templates and use System.io for free. In this video, you will learn how to set up a contact form on your blog. For this, you need to have a System.io account and a blog created with System.io. To use System.io for free please check the link in the video description. 1. Create a contact form. First, you will need to create a contact form from your sales funnel. To do so, go to your sales funnels, then create a new page, choose inline form, then the template of your choice. Then go to the form page editor by clicking on the edit page wand icon to set up the different inline form. A contact form must have at least one inline form, so you can put as many form fields as you want. Please select the form input item, then with the scroll wheel, set up the field in question by choosing an input type you wish to collect, by selecting an item from the drop-down list. It will also be necessary, to set the button, that will record the action to be done with the collected item. You can choose a time for the contact form to appear on your blog page, this time can be adjusted using the editor. The time to be indicated is in seconds. Don't forget to save your changes before leaving the page. 2. Create a contact form as a pop-up. Go to your sales funnel, then click on create a new page, choose pop-up form, then select the template of your choice. Then go to the pop-up form page editor by clicking on the edit page wand icon to set up the various pop-up forms. A contact form must have at least one pop-up form, so you can put as many form fields as you want. Please select the form input item, then with the scroll wheel, set up the field in question by choosing an input type you wish to collect by selecting an item from the drop-down list. It will also be necessary to set the button that will record the action to be done with the collected item. You can choose a time for the contact form to appear on your blog page, this time can be adjusted using the editor. The time to be indicated is in seconds. Don't forget to save your changes before leaving the page. Options of the contact form is pop-up. When setting up a contact form as a pop-up, there are two possible ways to display it on your blog page. In the form of a pop-up that is displayed according to a time setting. Or, in the form of a pop-up that is displayed by clicking on a text. 3. Setting up the contact form on your blog. In order to set up the contact form on your blog, you must retrieve its script and paste it on your blog page. The first step is to return to your form settings page. A pop-up will be displayed containing the code of your script linked to your contact form page. Click copy script to clipboard. You will then have to go to the editor of the blog page on which you want the contact form to appear. Then, you need to set up an HTML element on your blog page. Finally, you will need to go to the settings of your HTML element. Click on edit code and paste the script code retrieved from your contact form page into it. Be sure to save your changes before exiting your blog page settings. 4. Setting up the link of your contact form as a pop-up on your blog. You can display the contact form as a pop-up after clicking on a text. First you need to go back to your form settings page. Then you need to press create link. A pop-up will appear that will allow you to click on a link that opens the pop-up from a text. You have to choose the content of the text that will be clickable. You have to click on copy script to clipboard. To do so, you must go to the editor of the blog page on which you would like to post your blog. Then, you need to set up an HTML element on your blog page. Finally, you will need to go to the settings of your HTML element. Click on edit code and paste the script code retrieved from your contact form page into it. If you like this video please share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching, and see you soon.